And now we have our correspondent across the state of Kuwait showcasing the various celebration of the Liberation Day. First of all, we have our correspondent Maryam al from Sheikh Jabir al Ahmed Cultural Center. Good evening, ma'am, and thank you so much for being with us. Good evening, Ahmed, and good evening, everyone in the newsroom. Always a pleasure to have you. By the way, Lulu, I said hi. Before we start anything, we'd love for you to tell us and describe the activities, the spe specifically the festivities over in the place that you are in it. Yes, Ahmed, uh, the festivities here at Jabal Ahmed Cultural Center is headed and controlled by the National Guard of Kuwait. They are doing a marvelous show here. They started from uh, 11 a.m. and they are about to end like about one hour and uh, hour and 30 minutes uh, from now. Uh, the festivities contained uh, a display, a show of the vehicles of the National Guard. There is also a department of the National Guard here are in booths. Also, the, the most significant one and the one that everyone here likes is the central kitchen that supplies food and beverages for the National Guard uh, during practice. So everything here in the center is all controlled and provided by the National Guard. And hopefully by next year that Jabal Ahmed Cultural Center management will provide the National Guard more freedom to do more festivities because they are extremely organized and everyone here is celebrating the show and having a good time. There are contests, uh, children are having a good time. Also the parents here are enjoying the celebrations with their families in a safe environment. There is no uh, crazy and naughty activities like what's happening in the street because we are close to the uh, Arabian Gulf Street and we can see and hear many things but here inside Jabal Ahmed Cultural Center it's extremely amazing and lovely celebration. What about the presence of police officers to ensure the safety of the audience over there? Well, Ahmed, the presence of police and uh, fire department is uh, extremely limited. We can't see them only, ex uh, only outside the premise of Jabir Ahmed because uh, it's, uh, uh, there is uh, fences and it is a semi-private place. There is more control from the security here in Jabir Ahmed. Uh, police and uh, security details are all over uh, the, uh, the coastline. They are organizing the streets, they are making uh, sure that there is no incidents or any uh, violent activities. But overall, it's extremely under control. Maria Madwehi, we appreciate your presence at Sheikh Jabir Ahmed Cultural Center. And stay safe, please. 